वेलकम टू एच टू के इन्फोसिस एच टू के इन्फोसिस इज अ ई वेरीफाइड बिजनेस बेस्ड इन अटलांटा जॉर्जिया यूनाइटेड स्टेट्स वी प्रोवाइड हंड्रेड परसेंट जॉब ओरिएंटेड इंस्ट्रक्टर लेड फेस टू फेस थ्रू लाइव ऑनलाइन सॉफ्टवेयर ट्रेनिंग प्रोग्राम्स इट ऑल्सो इंक्लूड्स एक्सेस टू क्लाउड टेस्ट लैब विद सॉफ्टवेयर टूल्स वी प्रोवाइड लाइव प्रोजेक्ट फॉर यू टू वर्क ऑन वी ऑल्सो प्रोवाइड असिस्टेंस विद मॉक इंटरव्यूज रेज्यूमे प्रिपरेशन एंड रिव्यू एंड जॉब प्लेसमेंट असिस्टेंस एच टू के इन्फोसिस इज ट्रस्टेड बाई सो मेनी स्टूडेंट्स अक्रॉस द वर्ल्ड एच टू के इन्फोसिस प्रोवाइड्स वर्ल्ड क्लास सर्विसेस इन आई टी ट्रेनिंग विद रियल टाइम प्रोजेक्ट वर्क फॉर कॉर्पोरेट्स एंड इंडिविजुअल्स स्पेशल आई टी ट्रेनिंग फॉर एम एस स्टूडेंट्स इन द यूनाइटेड स्टेट्स सॉफ्टवेयर डिजाइन डेवलपमेंट क्यू ए मैनुअल एंड ऑटोमेशन परफॉर्मेंस टेस्टिंग एंड मेंटेनेंस आई टी स्टाफ ऑगमेंटेशन जॉब प्लेसमेंट असिस्टेंस एंड टेक सपोर्ट इन टूडेज वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू सी हाउ टू पैरामीटराइज अ टेस्ट ऑब्जेक्ट वैल्यू द पर्पज ऑफ पैरामीटराइजिंग अ टेस्ट ऑब्जेक्ट वैल्यू इज टू टेस्ट द ऑब्जेक्ट विद different data sets say for example h2k emphasis has multiple departments recruiting training training payments human resources and every employee logs into the system every morning the login process itself is the same but every employee might have a different user id so how are we going to test it we basically parameterize the test object with multiple values to see how the application is responding let's see how to do it on uft let's open a pre-recorded test script or record a new test script if you already do not have a pre-recorded test script if you do not know how to record a test script you may watch our video on how to record a test script on uft Let's launch UFT and open a test script. Launching UFT. Hit continue. Say okay. And now let's open a pre-recorded test script. go to file open test and open how to record test script and once the script is open let's go to the keyword view and select the object for which the value needs to be changed we are selecting agent name go to value and on the corner if you go click there'll be a little arrow or brackets click on uh, that little button so you will see this little box which says value configuration options and it has two different fields one says constant and the other one says parameter let's select parameter and change the name of the parameter to p underscore agent name and hit okay and once you hit okay you will most likely see the data page underneath underneath your page if you do not then go to view and click on data so what you will actually see is a is a page which looks like an excel sheet on which you can give multiple values let's say the first one is test 1 the second value is test 2 and the third value is test 3 so let's run the script with three different values so what is going to happen is the application is going to run it three different times or what we call it as iterations in uft
Let's go see the results. It actually ran the test two times since we only gave two um, values, test one and test two. So on the right hand side it says two iterations passed and when you click on the left hand side when you click on the object it says uh, the object value was test 1 and when you click on the second iteration it says the object value was test 2 so it ran the test twice since uh, we've given two values for the test now let's go save the test script and let's name it as parameterization So this is basically how you parameterize an object value on UFT. So many of our students have given testimonials on how our training programs are. You will find them on kudzu.com and on our website h2kinfosys.com. On our website h2kinfosys.com you will also find more detailed information on who we are, the courses that we offer, what each course covers. Also if you're interested in a demo program please register on our home page on the left hand side. Just give us more information about yourself and we will send you a link for a demo class. The demo class is absolutely free. Experience our commitment by just attending an orientation workshop at no cost. Our team of faculty and advisors are here to guide you with the right information. If you still have more questions, please feel free to call us. Call us at 770 Seven 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 one two six nine. This is a United States number. If you're calling from the UK, call us at zero two zero three three seven one seven six one five. You can also email us at training at h two k infosys dot com or h two k infosys at gmail dot com. Thank you for watching our videos. We wish you a great career in information technology.